let me teach you something that i do in the night sometimes don't just worship god by lying down on the ground <clears throat> one of the ways that you worship god is to worship him in the presence of what wants your worship yeah welcome to dynamics of youtube channel so today i'm going to be giving you a thoughtful revision on the podcast by apostle joshua Simon. what if all your midnight prayers you are missing the key step to unlocking the financial results you want this message reveals a powerful mystery worship god not just alone but in the presence of what seeks to steal your worship bring the symbol of your achievements your wallet your promotion letter and lay them before god forcing them to join in worship into you so you remind your soul that god alone is your source if you are doing all the praying but neglecting worship are you holding yourself back from divine favor and breakthrough could your next miracle be waiting for you on your worship make sure you watch this video and make sure you share it thank you so much let me teach you something that i do in the night sometimes don't just worship God by lying down on the ground. <clears throat> One of the ways that you worship God is to worship him in the presence of what wants your worship. It's a powerful mystery. I don't just worship God alone like that. Sometimes I carry every a representation of everything that looks like accolades. We all worship together whatever wants my worship must join me in worshiping god that is one of the ways to overcome the temptation of worshiping things so if it is your wallet i'm not saying idolize it your id card your promotion letter don't lie down and leave it on the table lie down with it lord this is what you have done for me and someone is calling you and saying you are now the ceo tell them wait but you are wasting time this is how i became the ceo please Yabone nakao Sujada ne nakao Sirkin salama Sirkin Can I tell you this? Let me give you an assignment by God. Every home and every individual try to take at least a day in this week. If you can't do it with your family, do it alone this busy busy hustling going up and down trying to do this you sit down in someone to the front of someone's office from morning till night and then they drive you again come back listen 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 sometimes we need to go back and just worship we are a people of prayer but we must also be a people of worship it is not just prayer alone learn worship if you can't sing let something sing for you that's the importance of technology give technology the assignment to sing for you and join you as you worship your maker and you bow before him and say lord it is because of you i am here and while you are saying it your wallet is hearing your atm is hearing you force them to join in that worship and god says this is for me now let me do for you what you cannot do for yourself you are done with that worship you pick up your phone and see missed calls and text messages and you are wondering this man i've been trying to call believe what i'm teaching you i will not waste your time this night these are these are mysteries you want to command results that will preach to a territory next sunday's miracle service People are coming with all kinds of burdens. I'm not a herbalist. How in the world do you think you are going to touch people and pray from here and people all over the world get healed, get blessed? Let me tell you, after I'm done praying, this ground is a blessing. You roll there and say, oh God, who but you is able to heal and bless and help and lift? And in that atmosphere of worship, that Shekinah just comes to mantle you. And it's like electricity from head to toe and head to toe. And there are all kinds of impartations. Yours is just to stay there. You come out of that atmosphere, the only thing that comes from you is fire from head to toe. Preachers, I'm not, I'm not, you can't sit down and watch a movie by morning and quickly just get up and take your bath and come for a miracle service and say, after all, it's Jesus doing it. 
did you tell him you know he's the one doing it I will lay down my idols and thrones I have made and all that has taken my heart Lord I will bow to you to no other God but you We have to rush. Please sit down. Spiritual emphasis. There are seasons of prayer and intercession. That's not the time to pray morning and evening. That's the time to pray anyhow and anytime. Because you are in a season. Your anchor will be your prayer. hallelujah day and night you are praying lord i don't know what is happening to my life but i'm praying you have your prayer time in the morning you have your prayer time in the evening but every time is prayer time every time is prayer time an evil report your wife just lost her child what are you doing i am praying why i'm in a season is any man afflicted james chapter 5 and verse 13 let him pray let him pray not let him discuss not let him grumble around not let him call god names and say i will backslide let him pray psalm 34 please from verse 4 to 7 and then the last part and we will pray psalm 34 i sought the lord and he heard me and delivered me from what all my fears next verse we're reading to four to seven they looked unto him and were lightened and their faces were not ashamed six the poor man cried and the lord heard him and saved him out of how many all his troubles last verse the angel of the lord encampeth around them that fear him and delivereth them prayer is a powerful weapon in all seasons but especially this season lord what is happening around my life my wife just got attacked my son just got attacked my job just got attacked i am not understanding what is happening i set myself like daniel onto prayer god grants you grace you can add with fasting add with fasting this spiritual laziness of eating anyhow anytime many believers now fast as a ceremony three days fasting you carry it on your head as if you as if it's, it's 12 years fasting If you love food more than your destiny life will cheat you again and again food is okay oh, but please let me tell you mighty ones you must learn to show food that your spirit man has grown above it there are many of you here you cannot remember I may be wrong I'm not saying you should do it please I'm not saying you should do it but as far as I'm concerned, there are spiritual levels that if you get to, a week should never pass that you did not fast. You are joking. You are joking. Not with what you are doing to hell. You are joking. Seven days. Ah, no. Himarama. <laughs> Himarama Himarama To the king who sits on the throne Himarama 
to the king listen let me tell you this i will continue to teach you this secret real victory real victory in prayer is gotten while men sleep real victory is not gotten shouting around just making noise real men of power contact power when men sleep may god give you the grace to rise above sleep i'm praying from the may god give you the grace to not allow sleep cheat you that god can wake you up in the night no light off the light you are praying don't allow distractions you are praying the next thing you see one of your trousers and it's enough to distract off the light you can use your phone light you are in the night alone and watch what happens you are nobody seeing what you are doing but there is a register every day you are signing it is the day you get to the stage to preach that's when god will not disappoint you You don't come on stage and talk nonsense lion of the tribe of judah rose of sharon lily of the valley rose of this and that and that god is not a scammer he's not a magician no track record in the secret place you will flatter yourself to nothing in it in the open please learn to pray in the night learn to pray in the night learn to pray in the night receive grace to dedicate night times and pray God didn't give you a house just to keep things. Turn everywhere to a prayer altar. Turn your toilet to a prayer altar. Turn your living room to a prayer altar. When everyone has gone off the television, don't pray watching a film. Even if it's a Christian movie, you are not praying. Shut it down. Lord, this is me and you here. I don't know what is happening to my life. A time will come, you'll feel like just leaning. Get up and say, Satan, you are a liar. I'm going far. A time will come, your tongues begin to change. What you are saying, it will never be what you started with. You, are, you, you have entered a level in the spirit. Tongues are languages and they are levels of power contact. Groanings that cannot be uttered. You get to a point in the spirit where you begin to pray. There are times that only one word, one phrase will come out of your mouth for minutes. Pray it. You are receiving power. is not something you do in a group so that people will see you and think you're a prayer warrior don't joke with your destiny like that don't joke with your destiny like that the bible says to enter and shut the door behind you shut the door behind you and pray to your father who is in secret you don't need to have a prayer point you don't need to have a prayer point just stay there and begin to pray Shekas kaparakatos, embrekete keleka takatos, shikos kamanakata. And while you are praying, your flesh is weak, but your spirit is willing. Can I tell you this? There is a level of fire you bring on any attack in your life. It must give way. It must give way. Fire is an emblem of the spirit. It's one of the emblems of revival. It's one of the emblems that show that the spirit is in a place. 
fire does not only refine fire is for judgment there are times you need to stay like a priest upon the watch my brother and my sister if you pray from your heart some things will shift you will wake up in the morning and know i shifted this through prayer there are attacks that only prayer can challenge pray for me pray for me is wonderful but you must become the priest of your destiny can someone just blast in tongues for just one or two minutes Salabakata. Senagandas kama hasabash. Ragata bakato sopokoto shegetelekata. Emprata seneketo shanikata. Sasete shana haskabaratos. Reketeketekete skabarakatos. Unto him that answers prayer shall all flesh come. Lord, I'm in a season of my life. I cannot afford to be lazy. I'm in a season of my life. I cannot allow my prayer life go down. It's too risky. Not for this season. Not for this season. This is the wrongest time to be prayerless. This is the wrongest time to be prayerless. Oh, take away slumber from my eyes. Take away slumber, oh God. Skabaratos kama. There are scores to settle in the realm of the spirit. There are things to shift in the realm of the spirit. There are things to align in the realm of the spirit. I need to legislate spiritual realities. While men slept, while men slept, the enemy came and saw tears. Pray. Pray. Outside, pray. Through the king who sits upon the wild Through the king who sits upon the wild Shela bakata rekotosia ni marama ni marama ni marama to the king who sits on the throne ni marama. To the king who sits on the throne. Eshela balala, ele, 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 ele. Ela barata katos, shabrande katela katos, ekata brakatos kale kata brashana kata, karuse sene katos shalatos ke mahasa. War to them who are at ease in Zion. War to them who are at ease in Zion. To the king who sits upon the white horse. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are praying. Psalm 125. Prayer gives you stamina to pass through seasons. Jesus prayed, otherwise, you would have given up. He said, Peter, Satan desired to sift you like wheat, but I have prayed for you that your faith fail not. And when you are converted, 
use the same strategy to strengthen strengthen prayer is a strengthener they that trust in the lord shall be as mount zion which cannot be moved but abided forever next verse as the mountains are around jerusalem so the lord is round about his people from henceforth even forever next verse for the rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the lot of the righteous lest the righteous put his hands in iniquity next verse do good O lord unto those that be good and to them that are upright in their hearts we're reading till the last verse as for such as turn aside in their crooked ways the lord shall lead them forth with the workers of iniquity but peace upon joshua selman prayer gives you stability in the next two three minutes you are going to pray and say lord let this prayer stabilize me i shouldn't be shaking over everything i should be able to laugh at certain storms and say jesus is lord lift your voice and pray stability power stamina The Lord is my light and my salvation. The Lord is the strength of my life. Stability, O oh God. Stability, O oh God. The Bible says if you turn aside in the day of battle, your strength is small. Your strength is small. Give me capacity, endurance, stamina. The grace to pass through for the sake of my family. The grace to pass through for the sake of my generation. The grace to pass through for the sake of my, my loved ones. Be strong, be strong, be strong. Be strong in the Lord. Don't be weak, be strong in the Lord. And in the power of His might. Be strong in the Lord. Koinonia, be strong in the Lord. Be strong in the Lord. Be strong in the Lord. Don't entertain weakness. Be strong in the Lord. You are not the weak ones. You are strong. Hallelujah. By the spirit that raised Christ from the dead, we crush the works of darkness now. pay attention I'm praying for you I decree and declare that if this is as a result of territorial covenants activities of ancestry that authorize darkness to launch attacks over lives over churches over ministries over individuals mysterious diseases that you had no part in i pray by the god of heaven tonight let there be liberty for you let there be liberty for you let there be liberty for you i challenge suicidal spirits over this territory of Zaria the spirits that cause young people to kill themselves and waste their lives in the name that is above all names we command that spirit is banished from this territory the spirit of discouragement the spirit of exhaustion in the name of Jesus we declare be gone now and forever. Yeah. 